Welcome to Wager Talk TV. I'm Kelly Stewart, joined by Steve Marilyn, Adam Trigger of wagertalk.com. We're headed to the Big Ten, where Wisconsin takes on the Iowa Hawkeyes. Now, this one's bounced back and forth. Iowa opened a one-point favorite. Now, Wisconsin a one-point favorite, and the total in true Big 12 fashion, Steve, is 34 and a half at the low, mostly 35 on the wager talk on screen. Tell me your thoughts on this one. I think this looks like a coin flip type game, though Iowa has shown some improvement over the last couple of weeks offensively. Yeah, I mean, the odds are saying it's pretty much a coin flip, right? And as we head into the weekend right now, we're seeing, if you look at the wager talk live odds screen, mostly Wisconsin by one, one and a half point range favorite. Uh, my math model disagrees with it slightly. It actually has Iowa winning by two. Uh, so I'll side to the Hawkeyes there, but there's not a huge difference between plus one, minus two, obviously. You know, one and two are somewhat dead numbers. We need to get to that key number of three for it to start to matter. But I do run 10,000 simulations with a lot of different situations, and it does, on average, have Iowa winning this game outright by two points. So I do think the wrong team is favored here. And I do believe you can start making a case for Iowa, um, a team that's off back-to-back -back wins and covers, and more importantly, back-to-back -back good offensive showings for the first time this season. This is a team on the year that's averaging just 17 points a game, but they've put up 33 and 24 in those past two wins against Northwestern and Purdue. Now, obviously, a bit of a step up in class here, but they were an underdog against Purdue and still won that game 24-3. So I think maybe that's the buy sign with the Hawkeyes' offense. And we've had the buy sign all year long with the defense, one of the best in the nation. 14 points per game and 3.9 yards per play allowed. Um, I will think they'll shut down somewhat a very mediocre, slightly above average Wisconsin offense the question is though can Iowa keep the offense going against a decent Wisconsin defense but I think I was the much better defensive team maybe in better current form and we get some value with them as well so I'll look I'll call for the mild upset Iowa Hawkeyes to win this one outright you could definitely take a look at them on the money line and get a little plus money there if you don't want to take the plus one and a half you get them at even plus 105 maybe on the money line Adam, last week on The Hustle, my best bet was Iowa. Was very happy with their performance. Are we going back to the well with them here? Absolutely, Cal. Iowa Hawkeyes, 4% client play for me. Uh, also, my best bet from The Hustle Show pod this week, so you can still check the replay of that out. Uh, I love Iowa in this spot. Listen, this team, if they figured out how to run the ball a few weeks ago, maybe a month ago, they'd probably be 7-2. and two. Uh, with losses to Michigan and Ohio State because two of their losses, they held their opponents to 10 points or less. Illinois and Iowa State, they just couldn't score. They just couldn't move the ball. But as Steve mentioned, they're starting to get it going a little bit offensively. 57 points the past two games. And the defense has been outstanding. They've held five opponents this year to their season low yards. They're also a turnover-creating machine. And when Wisconsin turns the ball over two or more times, they're 0-3 this season. It's going to be windy. Uh, both these teams played in wind last week, so I don't think that that's a huge deal. Uh, but you're probably looking at 20-mile-an-hour winds. And I will say this, the, the team that probably benefited more from that last week was Wisconsin because Maryland is not the type of team that, that's going to excel playing in weather. Uh, these two teams will be fine in this setting. I was going to try to run the ball in this Wisconsin defense. You know, Wisconsin's improved a little bit over the last couple of weeks, but their defense is not what it's been in the last couple seasons. I think I was going to run the ball here without issue. I think they will create turnovers because that's what their defense does against a mediocre Wisconsin offense. I can't believe I was not a favorite here. I would have made this number Iowa minus three. So at plus one, give me the Iowa Hawkeyes all day, Cal. Best bet, uh, you know, 4% client play for me this week. Awesome stuff from Steve and Adam. Steve, thank you for filling in for the legend Dave Koken. Dave, we hope you feel better. And don't forget to go over to the Wager Talk YouTube channel. Of course, we've got every single game video you could ever want. Just drop in the search bar and you'll find it.